Are you relocating to Norman, Oklahoma and wondering about the cost of living? Well, we're gonna talk about that today, so don't miss out. Hey there, I'm Heather Evers with Norman Homes and Lifestyle, brokered by Century 21. Today, we're gonna talk about the cost of living here in Norman, Oklahoma. Say hi to my lovely assistant, Miss Lulu. She snuck in for a little video time. So, Norman is really, really well-priced. It's really affordable to live here. We have homes, the median price range at about 200,000. You can certainly buy something for less or you can spend all the way up into the multi-millions. Um, but you know, mid-range is about 200,000. We also have a lot of diversity in the style of homes here in Norman. You're gonna see a lot of just traditional. Um, there are a lot of kind of little cookie cutter neighborhoods in the lower price ranges. We do have some more modern options. It's not as easy to find something really um, industrial here. You kind of have to go into downtown Oklahoma to get some more of that. There are a few designers though that are putting some of those sprinkling, sprinkling them in around Oklahoma. We really have a lot of affordable entertainment options too. There's a lot of food options. Uh, Tex-Mex is an enormous thing here. And if you have not visited Terra Humeras, or Tara Humara's, everybody says it different. It is just quintessential Oklahoma, amazing little restaurant. I feel like they, like they're psychic. They know what you're gonna get before you get there because that's how quickly your food comes out. It's like they already knew. We have a lot of museums and festivals and things like that too. Things to keep you busy and to take the family. All again, very affordable options. Some of our museums that you should really check out are the Sam Noble Oklahoma Museum of Natural History. It has got all kinds of things that the kids love. I love it too. Lots of dinosaurs. They've got minerals and rocks and animal exhibits and um, pretty much just everything you want to see there. We also have the Fred Jones Museum of Art, which is actually on OU's campus. Go OU! It is just a really neat uh, art museum that has a lot of like traveling exhibitions. Their exhibitions include a lot of American and European art. So a little something for everybody there. We also have the Norman Firehouse Art Center, which is a great place to take your kids or yourself. They have all kinds of art classes, pottery classes, painting classes, and lots of little, little goods to sell from local artists. So you should also check out Norman's festivals. We have some really good free options for everybody to come out and just hang out and have a good time. The Norman Music Festival is held annually in the spring. It features a lot of local and national bands really something you need to check out if you're a music lover. The Norman Medieval Fair is probably my personal favorite. They really bring out the people watching. Not only do the people who are holding the festival dress up, but many of the people who attend come in full, full on costume. Um, so you need to check that out. Grab a turkey leg, throw an ax, you know, that kind of thing. For a college town, I think that we really have a lot of affordable options here. A lot of ways to stay entertained and not spend a lot of money there either. So if you think you'd like living in a college town that's very affordable in housing, very affordable in entertainment, very affordable in dining, then Norman just might be the place for you. If you need help relocating, I would absolutely love to lend a hand. You can check out another one of my videos on the pros and cons of living in Norman. So don't forget to like my video, subscribe, and then hit that little notification bell so that you find out when I post a new video. We're looking forward to meeting you.